Tyler McGill, whom the Mets have played very well behind and who's pitched extremely well in his small number of starts, but this is a huge test tonight. Marcus Simeon leads off for the Jays, and Simeon hits one on the ground right at VR. And he throws out Simeon for the first down. So a one out walk issued to Bichette just the 25th walk he's drawn this season. That'll set the table for Vladdy Guerrero Jr. And a full count to Guerrero. And he struck him out. Throw to second by McCann. The good tag by Guillaume. But they don't get the call. Great tag by Guillaume on that short hop throw. Looked like McCann was going to get him. It's a strikeout from McGill as he gets Guerrero, but Bichette steals the base his 13th. Runner in scoring position with two out. And now George Springer, and he gets one of the air, a pop up behind short. Retreating his VR, waves everybody else away, makes the catch, side retired. Donald McGill works around a walk in the first inning. Steven Matz makes his return to City Field, the first start back at home for the left hander since the Mets traded him away. Very odd to see Steven Matz in any uniform except the orange and blue. 3 1 to Nimmo, and the force field in effect. Nimmo's on with a leadoff walk. That's 11 walks in his last seven games. That will bring up Pete Alonso. 1 1 pitch. Alonso lines one in the air to deep left. Hernandez just turns, watches. It's gone. Home run number 20 for Pete Alonso. And the Mets have a 2 to nothing first inning lead. 89th career home run, which ties him with Gary Carter on the Mets' all-time home run list. Oh, they have a new thing. You know, they got teams with the swag chain. They got the laundry basket. It's like now you have the camel horse. Now you got the pony. Here's J.D. Davis. 2-2 pitch, changeup, and a good one. Swing and a miss as Davis strikes out, two down. Another 3-2 pitch from Steven Matz. Got him. Chased the high fastball and strikes him out. Back-to-back -back strike ass, but the Mets jump out to a 2-0 lead. But now McGill has retired the first two on the ground here in the second inning. Kevin Biggio coming up. There's a breaking ball hammered on the line in the right field. Craig Biggio gets the benefit of watching his boy come up with a base hit. First hit for the Blue Jays. Two-out single, and it'll bring up the catcher, Alejandro Kirk. A little tapper. Off the mound comes McGill. Plenty of time. Side retired. One away. Here's Jonathan VR. There's a changeup hit on the ground. Vigio was in to guard against the bunt. It's an easy play for him, and VR is retired. 5 3 on the put out, two away. So here's Guillaume, left hand batter. That's lined the other way, and Guillaume's got an opposite field hit. So they play him to pull, and he goes to left field. Third base runner, and it gets the pitcher to the plate. Swing and a miss, that'll do it. Steven Matz has found his release point, throwing the ball very well. Now he'll lead things off for the Jays. Steven Matz leads off the third, and he'll get a nice hand from the crowd at City Field. Swing and a ground ball, softly hit to short. VR grabs it, has to hurry, throw to first in time. Matz can still move down the line. He was thrown out by a step. One out, nobody on it. Swing and a miss, strike three. A good tight slider in the dirt. Simeon went after it. Tyler McGill with a couple of strikeouts. Brandon Nimmo leads off the third against Mats. And there's another good fastball swinging this by Nimmo. That's four strikeouts now for Steven Mats. He had a little bit of a hiccup to start the game, but he's pretty well locked in right now. There's a good changeup swing and a miss by Dominic Smith. Steven Matz with five strikeouts through three innings. Mets lead 2 0. And now George Springer. Line, but right at VR, two out. Two up, two down. McGill's retired six straight. And now the batter, Teoscar Hernandez. And Hernandez goes down swinging. Good changeup by McGill to get him. That's three strikeouts for Tyler. He's now retired seven in a row. Second walk issued by Matz. That snaps a string of four in a row retired. Another fastball hit on the ground to Bo. Second for one. Back to first. Double play. That was a 6 5 3 double play. Yes. Kevin Biggio, the third baseman, was in the shift, and he took the throw at second. Batter will be James McCann. Swinging on the first pitch. Nice play at third by Biggio. Long throw. Good scoop over at first. Great play on both ends. Blue Jays will have Richick, Biggio, and Kirk do up. It's the first pitch on the ground toward the hole. Cut off nicely by Davis. Spin around, and he got it. Oh, wow. J.D. Davis. With the great extension and showing off that wonderful arm, and he gets the out on Gritchick for the first out of the fifth. Now we've seen each third baseman make a gem just for the last two outs. Here's the other one, Biggio. 
Swing and a miss at a high hard one. And McGill's got his fourth strikeout. He's now retired nine in a row as he gets Biggio. Pitcher Steven Matz will come up. 3 2, the pitch. In there, strike three called. Side retired. He got him with a fastball. And for McGill, his fifth strikeout. No runs a hit, one left. Tyler McGill will get his second at bat. And he lines one to right field, and he's got his first big league hit. Tyler McGill in his ninth major league at bat <laughs> has his first safety. And they'll take that ball out of play. Round of applause. Outstanding. This crowd has come to really appreciate Tyler McGill yeah. in a big hurry. And now the Mets have runners at first and second. And here comes the maestro, I suppose, Pete Alonzo. Do it again. Gets the pop up. Guerrero's got room in foul ground. And Matz gets out of it. Terrific job by Steven Matz to strand a pair. One out and nobody on now, Bo Bichette. And he gets jammed and bloops one into shallow right. On comes Conforto to dive and make the catch. Oh, wow. I didn't know the Olympic diving competition had begun yet. <laughs> Michael Conforto makes the latest really good defensive play in this game. And I'm talking about for both teams. This is as good a display of defense as we've seen in a while. The 1 0 to Guerrero. Fastball chopped left side, charged by the shortstop VR. He's up with it. Throws to first in time, side retired. A four pitch, sixth inning for Tyler McGill. Well, Tyler McGill just had a four pitch inning. He's thrown 78 pitches in six scoreless innings, but it appears that he is done for the day. Here's J.D. Davis. Change up popped up over near the Mets dugout. Guerrero is there and he makes the catch. Two down. So the Mets get a two out base runner. Uh, that's going to be it, apparently, for Steven Matz with right hand hitting James McCann coming up. Nice hand for a nice homecoming for Steven Matz. Not exactly what he'd hoped, but he pitched well after Alonzo's home run. But Adam Simber is in to face James McCann with a runner at first and two down. Bouncing ball over the mound. Bichette has time to throw out to catcher and Simber dispatches the Mets in the six. Randall Gritchick found the hole in the shift and he's got a two out single. This inning continues for Kevin Biggio. Pulled down to first. Alonzo has a trickle through. Backed up by Guillaume. Throws to Alonzo and gets the out. Guillaume Johnny on the spot after it got through Alonzo. The 3 4 3 put out gets Lugo through the inning. So one away and here comes Alonzo. Uh -oh. In the air to deep left center, and Alonzo is struck again into the second deck. An enormous home run by Alonzo. Second of the night. There's your insurance. 3 0 New York. 450 feet into the second deck in left center. He's uh, letting that pony ride him. Well, we go to the ninth inning here at City Field. The Mets lead the Blue Jays 3 0. Edwin Diaz comes to the mound for the Mets. Bichette lines one to left. In comes Dom Smith, and he picks it off for the out. One batter, one line drive, one out for Diaz. Line center field. Nimmo retreating. He's got it. two out. Two batters, two line drives, two outs. And now the Jays are down to their final strike. He struck him out, and the ball game is over. Diaz gets back on the horse with a 1 2 3 ninth for the save. Tyler McGill picks up his first major league win with six scoreless innings, and the Mets with their second straight shutout.